Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to another Inform Player Review and we have second Inform Max Cruiser from this week's Team of the Week and ignore the red card by the way in the team screen, it was in the last game. I don't even know why it was a red, but yeah, ignore that. If you are wanting to actually see any other reviews from this week's Team of the Week, make sure to drop their name in the comment section. Also, leave a like, I'd appreciate that. And if you are needing Ultimate Team Coins to afford these players, head over to FIFA Ultimate Team Coins for the Black Friday deals. Use the code FUJI for 15% off, or if you are needing game codes, head over to G2A and use the code FUJI on that side. But Max Cruiser, let's get into it. So Max Cruiser's card is naturally a center forward, and I decided to play him in the full snide form been loving it recently and the team that I actually played him around wasn't too bad it's probably I guess 7 out of 10 if I have to rate it but the stats on his card are actually pretty damn good for 35,000 coins that you pay 77 pace 86 shot 83 passing 86 dribbling 42 defense and 77 physical so I played six games scoring four goals and getting two assists now he could have had a lot more assists but it's just because of the other players not able to finish it match rating wise he started off really positive getting goals and then he kind of drifted off and, and became the assister in the side so yeah just just pay attention to that but the in-game stats like ball control crossing uh, short passing even positioning which is one thing I did pick up on he does like to get himself into space and he works the ball around well weak foot he's got a very very good weak foot I managed to score some with uh, with that and uh, yeah like overall it doesn't look too bad of a card he doesn't have the four star skills but he makes up for that with his high ball control and he yeah like I say he can actually move it around really really well so if you want to pause the video and check out his in-game stats do it now but we are ready to check what he's like in action let's do it so the stats on his card for an 83 rated player look promising but how does he fare in game now one thing i will say straight off not trying to sound like an absolute pace abuser he's on the slowest he's not the quickest he's right in the middle where it becomes a little frustrating at times you're through on goal and your opponents will bully him like his balance his strength isn't the best so a bit of advice i would give you because of that high positioning it just gives him that little bit of an edge so you can play into him then he's got time and space to dictate the play play either to the wings or someone else in space and uh, yeah i really like that about his game but the only problem with that is that yeah he can't skill He's got good roulettes and the occasional ball roll here and there, but I'd actually keep it to L2, R2, and that is the way to go. When it comes to shooting, he was a little inconsistent, but that's what you would expect with an 83 rated card. Some games he'd be able to finesse it, even shoot it across goal with his weak foot, and then other times he'd miss sitters. But yeah, he has potential to score a lot of goals. I've mentioned his dribbling, uh, his strength, you know, it's not the best. And overall, I'm going to have to say that I did enjoy my time using him, but he's not like an exciting player. He just lacks that spark. Like I was using Hamas Rodriguez um, a couple of days ago, and he is the complete package for that centre forward position. Whereas uh, Max Cruiser, yes, he does get the job done. But if I were to use him again, I'd bring him back to that cam role, and I think he, it would benefit the side a little bit more. As a centre forward, it's he's not that fun. I'm going to be honest. Like he can score goals, but it's all about enjoying yourself on Ultimate Team. But for 35,000 coins, and he will be dropping uh, when Friday comes for the Black Friday deals he's going to be uh, around about 20 maybe even discard so definitely worth picking up there but overall i'm going to give cruiser an 8 out of 10 and for a value of, a value of coins when friday does come around it's going to be a 9 out of 10 for sure but thanks ever so much for watching guys let me know any players you'd like me to review next and yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you soon Peace.